In this video, key indicator shows money beginning to flow back into Bitcoin. The question then becomes, when should we expect the price of Bitcoin to shoot to the upside? Also in this video, we'll be doing some technical analysis on Bitcoin and Atom to help understand the direction of the price in the immediate short term. In addition to this, we'll be looking at the cryptocurrency fear and greed index to help understand the general sentiment in the cryptocurrency market. Finally, this video will not be complete without going to CoinMarketCap to see how the cryptocurrency ecosystem is holding up. And if you would like to know what the motivational quote is for today, you definitely need to watch this video to the very end. That being said, my name is Enes Cosmic and welcome to Finance Your Independence. If you're new to this channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification button to be notified each time we post a new video. Also understand that anything said in this video should not be considered as financial advice. Be sure to do your own research before investing any of your hard and money into a volatile cryptocurrency market. All right, let's get it. So according to a CoinDesk article, key indicator shows capital beginning to flow back into Bitcoin. The stablecoin supply ratio oscillator is recovering in a sign of renewed capital inflow into Bitcoin. Haha, -ha. the question is, am I surprised? Of course I'm not surprised, because according to the words of Michael Saylor, who happens to be the CEO of MicroStrategy. He said Bitcoin is the apex predator of the human race. Bitcoin is a swarm of cyber hornets serving the goddess of wisdom, feeding on the fire of truth, exponentially growing ever smarter, faster, and stronger behind a wall of encrypted energy. And like I keep telling you, Bitcoin is not going anywhere. The entire cryptocurrency ecosystem can only grow from here. Whales can manipulate the market all they want. However, at the end of the day, we know what's going to happen. If you don't already know, we are living in an exponential age in terms of cryptocurrency adoption. And what that means is that eventually everything goes up. Not literally, but you get the point. That's why I keep saying do not pay attention to the day-to-day -day movement in price of Bitcoin and other cryptocurrency assets that you believe in. It's just a matter of time we are going to see the mother of all bull runs like we've never seen before. All right, let's go ahead and do some technical analysis on Bitcoin and Atom to see where the price goes in the immediate short term. Over here, I'm on the one hour chart for Bitcoin, and as you can see, we are currently trading at $32,709 per token. Bitcoin just did a double bottom right here at $32,289. The question becomes, are we going to bounce off of this as support and make our way back up to retest this level of $34,757 per token? The other scenario that could happen right here is for us to come back to retest the bottom line of this rectangle, which is serving as support at $31,156. Looking at everything that is happening in the cryptocurrency ecosystem, this is not the time for you to be in a long or short position. The reason for that is the kind of manipulation we are seeing in the market can cause both shorts and long to get liquidated at the same exact time, which is crazy. The best thing for you to position yourself to benefit from whatever is going to come in the immediate short or long term is for you to continue to dollar cost average into your Bitcoin position so you don't get wrecked as a result of this manipulation we are seeing in the price of Bitcoin. When all is said and done, we are going to see a parabolic move in the price of Bitcoin all the way to six figures and beyond. Let's go ahead and do some technical analysis on Atom, which is the utility token for the Cosmos network. Over here, I'm on the one hour chart for Atom, and as you can see, we are currently trading at $9.27. Yesterday, we saw this huge run up in the price of Atom all the way to $10.70 before getting rejected all the way down to $9.18. Currently, it's possible that we might come back to retest this support level at $9.02 before making another move to the upside. A few days from now, the Cosmos Network team will be releasing Gravity Dex, which is going to be the most advanced interchain decentralized exchange for the Cosmos Network. This Dex is going to bring massive utility to the Atom token. So what we are seeing right now with the price of Atom, this is just the calm before the storm. So if you're not already positioned, better position yourself for what is coming. All right, let's go ahead and look at the Crypto Fear and Greed Index to help understand the general sentiments in the cryptocurrency market. Over here, I'm on the official website for Crypto Fear and Greed Index. Yesterday, we recorded 22, which was Extreme Fear. Today, that number is 27, which is Fear. One thing you have to understand about the Cryptocurrency Fear and Greed Index is that whenever this number is very close to 100, it means investors are extremely greedy, which is an indication that the market is due for a correction. Whenever this number is very close to zero, 
it gives you another opportunity to buy the dip. Some share is always good for the market because it prevents the market from overheating. Let's head over to CoinMarketCap to see how the cryptocurrency ecosystem is holding up. Over here, I'm on the official website for CoinMarketCap. And as you can see, the global cryptocurrency market capitalization is now sitting at 1.32 trillion US dollars, which is a 3.73% decrease over the last 24 hours. Looking at the 10 largest cryptocurrencies by market cap, Bitcoin is down 4.6%, Ethereum is down 9.5%, Tether is a stable coin, Binance coin is down 7.6%, Cardano is down 6.5%, Dogecoin is up 3.8%, XRP is down 5.7%. USD coin is a stable coin, Polkadot is down 8.3% and Binance USD is a stable coin and is down 0.05%. Overall, the entire market is in the red. It's just a matter of time before the market decides whether to make a power move to the upside or to continue to the downside. So there you have it. What do you think about a key indicator showing capital is beginning to flow back into Bitcoin? Leave your feedback in the comment section below. Before you go, here is a motivational quote to consider. Look well into thyself. There is a source of strength which will always spring up if thou wilt always look by Marcus Aurelius. That's all I have for you for today. My name is Anas Cosmic. See you on the next one. If you've gained some value from this video, please smash the like button and share this video with your friends. If you are new to this channel, please subscribe and hit the bell notification button to be notified each time we post a new video. That's all I have for you for today. My name is Ines Cosmic. Thank you for watching.